this time of year, we can start to see lots of slugs about. So what is a slug? A slug is a particular kind of invertebrate called a mollusk, an animal with a very soft body. Most mollusks, like clams, oysters, and scallops, have a shell. Some mollusks, like octopuses and squid and slugs, don't. So a slug is basically a snail without a shell. There are freshwater slugs, sea slugs, and land slugs, like the ones we usually run into, especially this time of year. Slugs have two sets of tentacles on, this, on their heads, one set for seeing and one set for smelling and tasting. They can retract their tentacles, that is, pull them back inside their bodies if they sense danger. They breathe through a hole on the side of their head. Can you imagine squirming across the ground without a shell, without bones, with just the ability to move by contracting or squeezing muscles on your belly? That's the life of a slug. The slug's whole body is covered in mucus or slime. The slime helps it move and also stick to surfaces so it can climb. Climbing by sliming. The scientific word for this is viscous, which means sticky or slimy. Slime! Wait a minute! Slime! I just said the magic word! Slug slime is made of a mixture of proteins and sugar and water. It's basically snot. Want to make some slug slime? Here's the recipe. For slug slime, you need approximately 7 cups of water, 10 tablespoons of Metamucil powder, and a pot to heat the mixture on the stove. Make sure you have a grown-up to help. Dissolve the Metamucil powder in the water and then heat the mixture on the stove, stirring fairly continuously for about 5 minutes or until it's the desired consistency. Be sure to let it cool before playing with it. I hope you enjoyed this exploration of slug slime. Thanks for joining me.